everybody back with a Dia and Co box um, I actually just got a box three weeks ago and that one came within a couple weeks of the box before so Dia is really pushing getting the boxes out right now um, my last month's box I didn't keep anything in I felt like it was very quickly rushed out to me um, I had a different stylist, and I had had a, the same stylist for eight or ten months, um, and I felt like they just quickly sent me out another box. And here I am, this is three weeks later, and here's another one, but we'll see when we get into it. I didn't really comment anything too harsh other than the fact that I thought that they hurried up with a box and didn't... Um, listen to my comments or my Pinterest page or, or what I would like or dislike in them. Um, and I think that that goes with having a new stylist. I, you build a relationship with the one that you have, and I have a new one again. Um, so it says that my old stylist, Alexandra, has moved to a different apartment. So that's why I have a new stylist again. Um, so I'll just have to build the relationship with this new person and hopefully they don't change me every month to somebody new. But last month I didn't keep anything. Um, it, if you look at my old video, it was down to a top that I, the only one I might have kept had a couple of circles. The placement of it was not going to work. So um, I ended up not keeping anything. So let's get into here and see what this new new stylist has sent. So first off is a dress, East Adeline, and it looks like a maxi. It's very long. Um, it is a brown, kind of a brown, but almost has a hint of like a burgundy in there too. Um, with some flowers, fall colors. It looks like a loose, maybe three quarter or to the elbow sleeve. Um, yeah, can't count it out. I'll try it on. I'm not usually much of a dress and skirt wearer. This is skies are blue, and this is a top, very comfortable feeling um, fabric, colorful flowers, some embroidery around the neck. I wish it was a little bit brighter. It's kind of, the flowers are kind of dull looking, but um, I'll try that on. I see a lot of people get skies are blue in their boxes and usually they're very colorful printed tops. This is Dex. Burgundy with some um, eyelet lacy trim in the back and a little keyhole closure scoop neck in the front. This is um, cute, pretty, and the material is very soft. I like the feel of it. It's a good, good cotton. So I'm excited to try that on. <clears throat> then we have Slink Jeans, a boyfriend cut. And these look to be Cropped. They look short with a rolled hem, and that hem can be unrolled. Um, lots of distressing. They look very similar to a pair that I had already bought um, not too long ago from my Stitch Fix box. We'll try those on. And last, Co Coquette A Coqueen. So this is kind of French. <laughs> and this is like an army green color. 
got some tissue. Um, a stiffer kind of a cotton. It has some false pockets at the chest, a silver zipper, some button pockets. Are they real? Yes, they are. And a drawstring. Um, full length sleeve. Yep, full length sleeve with buttons. I have been, been asking for a coat, a fall coat. It's got a little tail there with a stitch in it now, but it could be um, taken out. So I am excited to try this on too. Let's hope the prices aren't terrible. So I'll get these things tried on and we'll see what we think. So this is the East Adeline Malibu Boho Maxi Dress for $69. Um, kind of on the fence here because I don't really like the, the pattern or the color and there's something about the arms that I don't care for but then it's kind of slimming and, and flattering so it's it's a conflicting dress for me. Um, it's very long, like it's too long for me, it's dragging on the floor and I can't wear heels so I'd have to have that taken up if I were going to keep it. Um, I'm not. I, I, there's something about it that I don't care for and I'm not really looking for a maxi dress or any dress right now. Um, I'm more looking for going into fall work kind of clothes and I can't wear dresses to work so um, this is a no for me. So I've got a few things on this time. This is the Pennington's Bevan Utility Jacket in olive green for $78. Um, I thought it was going to be too big but really it's just a little bit. I mean it's it fits for the most part. The arms are a little long, not terrible, so I just rolled it up once on this side. Um, I have a little bit of extra room here, but if I pull these strings to their max, which is right now, um, it's not as bad. There are some little snips that you make at the, the bottom of the back if you're going to keep it. Um, the zipper feels a little bit catchy in spots. You know how sometimes you can just kind of feel it. I felt it when I was putting it on. Um, these pockets are real, so you can really go into those, but these up here are not. They're just, they're just false pockets. Oh, there's that catch again. So I don't know about the jacket. I kind of like it, but um, we'll see about the, I'll play with the zipper a little more and make sure it's not going nothing's gonna happen to me. And I have it with the Slink Jeans, the Varric Rolled Boyfriend Jeans with Destruction in a dark wash for $89. Um, I have one side rolled up and one side down. I'm not going to keep these only because I just um, got a pair from my Stitch Fix box that are pretty much the same thing. But these jeans um, fit good and I like the distressing. I always worry about too much though because then I'm just going to end up with a big old hole when these break through. Um, but they're cute and they fit good. I have this top on which is this is the Skies Are Blue Ellen Short Sleeve Split Neck Blouse in a navy peach color for $45. And this is cute. Um, I wasn't sure about the pattern in it at first because it's kind of old looking but it's kind of like boho maybe. Um, I like the embroidery. I like the wrinkle stretch fabric. I don't know what this is but I like it. So possibly this, possibly the jacket. I'll be back with the last shirt. The last top in this box is the Dex Plus Ramsey Crocheted Tee in Burgundy for $49. Um, it has a keyhole back and this crochet up at the top. It is a very nice, um, stretchy, good laying um, shirt. The only thing that I noticed when I put it on was that it seemed to do something funky right here, like it bunched up or something, like it just did. Um, but maybe that won't be a pattern. Maybe that's just a one-time thing. But I have quite a few things from this box that I kind of like. That last blouse, this blouse, the 
olive green jacket. The jeans I could keep if there was something else in the box that I was going to do a five for five, but I really don't like that dress. Um, I know it's it feels like it's flattering, but it's not my style. I don't really care for the, the cut or the color. So the total for this box is $330, and styling fee and 25% off would bring that down to $227. Um, Got to think about that jacket. $78 and the two tops were about $45.50 a piece. So it's down to one of the three of those. I don't know about maybe a couple tops in the jacket. That would be 80 and 80, about 160. So I'll have to think about those.